temps in the low 80s both days and just widely scattered shower. Sunday looks to be a little bit more humid and maybe even a little bit more stormy later into the day and the night as this front comes through. And that's really going to bring some cooler air for next week. If you missed hearing it earlier, Mike is hinting at by Monday night and into Tuesday, we're going to be talking about frost on some lawns. Going from record and your record highs over the next few days to frosty weather again. How quickly that happens. Uh, it's sunny and 68 at Jacksonville Severe Weather Station. Now, safe touch security first alert traffic. Cars on Phillips Highway heading south. I knew a crash that says Shad Road taking out the left lane. I'm looking at the traffic maps now. There's some minor congestion building in the area. Give yourself an extra four minutes to get through the area there. If you're leaving the beaches on JTB westbound, that broken down vehicle that was between Southside Boulevard and Belfort Road has cleared. It's now an incident free drive. Just 11 minutes between A1A and 995. With Jacksonville's most frequent traffic, I'm Brian Riley. 843 as Jacksonville's only all-news morning show continues. Coming up next. Four firefighters are recovering after getting burned while battling a house fire in Northwest Jacksonville. I'm WOKB Stephen Fonson with one thing the JFRD fire chief is praising that prevented those burns from being worse. WOKB News Time 844. Brian Kilmeade here. If you're looking for some assurance in these crazy times, let me recommend my friends at Gordon Chevy. They're respectful of your time, always striving to get you into your new car in about an hour. They've got a huge selection of SUVs, like new Tahoes, Suburbans, and the new Equinox. In fact, this month at Gordon Chevy, get into a new Equinox with savings up to $6,600. So go see my friends at Gordon Chevy in Orange Park and tell them Brian Kilmeade sent you.